No. All right, we are tracking some storm chances for later today and another chance for some showers and storms on Saturday. So because of those two chances, there's a flood watch in effect through Saturday evening goes into effect later this afternoon. We have a lot of rain building in. We already have a pretty soggy ground, so we could be dealing with some localized flooding again later Saturday. Sunday, though, looking quieter and a little sunnier. We are looking at a pretty dry start to the day. Temperatures in a comfortable spot right now. A few thin high clouds moving on through. Here's our severe potential for today. That slight risk northwest of Dane County. The storms will be building in towards La Crosse, really stretching up into Juneau and Adams County, coming in at about 3, 4 o'clock. So looking at this line right now, still up towards the Twin Cities, but it starts to gain some strength in the early afternoon. And as it pushes southeast, it builds into this warm, really humid environment. So there's the potentials for some really high wind and large hail along this line. Juneau and Adams County, what we're keeping an eye on. This breaks apart as it does move southeast, but that doesn't mean that we aren't still expecting strong thunderstorms as the line kind of fizzles just a bit. Looking ahead to about 9, 10 o'clock, you can see becoming a little more widely scattered instead of really, really tight. And that way we see a bit of a break overnight before that next chance for showers and storms comes in on Saturday. This starts by about 3, 4 o'clock close to Juneau and Adams County and then wrapping up later this evening. High wind and some large hail are primary concerns here. High temperatures today will be in the middle to upper 80s with heat index readings pushing into the 90s. So with the storm chances and those humid conditions, probably an inside fish fry kind of night. If you can do it on the stove be a good idea or just pop out real quick. You can make that happen. We are tracking those shower and storm chances for Friday and into Saturday and that chance this evening and then another round expected on Saturday evening. Sunday and Monday we will see mostly sunny skies with high temperatures expected to land in the lower 80s. So that actually is going to give us a nice little break in the rain. And so we'll see that break and then we're going to move into a little bit of a warming trend heading into Tuesday.